Hello human, thank you for being on the channel. Will the Batman be a one and done? Or will it turn into a trilogy? Are we going to get two films out of it? I heard that the initial plan was to have this be a trilogy. Um, but I think that because of whatever problems they've been having making this movie... Perhaps whatever problems is going on with Robert Pattinson, all of which that I hope, you know, are false. Um, I think really what we're looking at is it depends on how successful the Batman is. And then that will determine if we get a second and a third one. Because if this doesn't do well, I don't see them going the trilogy route. And and when I say do well, I mean financially, because this movie could be great, right? But if you don't have a lot of humans that support it, then unfortunately, it doesn't matter how great it is, because in Hollywood, they're all about making money. And if something has proven to be a financial failure, then they just move on to the next thing. It's not really worth it to make another film or to make a trilogy out of such a concept. But I do believe that the movie will be very good. It could prove to be great. I like how they're setting things up, the tone and the look of everything, all the different villains they're going to introduce, Batman Year Two and all that. And, you know, Robert Pattinson looks on point based on that trailer. So I'm expecting nothing but good things. I feel like uh, once I watch this movie and say if it proves to be terrible, I will be greatly disappointed, especially that I've had my ups and downs with opinions in regards to this movie. You know, at first I was like on the fence because it's like I was going to watch it no matter what, because it's DC and because it's Batman. Batman is my favorite superhero, but I just was concerned about what they were going to do with everything creatively. And I was concerned that, you know, maybe the role would be too much for Robert Pattinson. Because playing Batman is not an easy thing to do. It's really not. Um, so now that I've seen, you know, photos and a trailer, I'm, I'm not worried anymore. I'm just more curious now of what the film entails. Like, what's in this film? You know, is it going to be just based on the long Halloween are they pulling from a lot of different Batman storylines? Like, what's up? So I am definitely excited about this movie. And I can't wait to see it. You know, I hope that everybody stays safe and that uh, Robert Pattinson is doing better. I hope he got over the whole COVID thing. And uh, yeah, I can't wait to see my boy on the big screen, man. And I don't want to see the Batman on no fucking streaming service. I really don't. I don't want to see the Batman on no streaming service. Black Widow, Wonder Woman 84. I don't want to see none of that shit on no streaming, man. I want to see it in the fucking theaters. But in this day and age, man, that seems like one of those things like theaters. You know, while you got some of them open around the world, obviously most of them are not. And the ones that do open, they keep closing that shit down. So you just don't know anymore in terms of just these big movies coming to the theaters anymore. So... I guess I'll take what I can get. I would rather see the movie than not. But I really want to see this on the big screen. And I hope that it's good. Because these films are meant to be seen on the big screen. They really are. Thank you for being here, human. Terrence out.